so pretty much, if you don't know, I got fired. I've been fired hella times, hella times. And my mom's tired. She's She think I'm working. So I have to leave every morning. Is that fucked up? I have to leave every morning to go work. I feel like the dude off a of, uh, baby boy. I'm leaving nine o'clock. Come back around six. Acting like I'm out there doing something constructive. Anyways, I'm about to go to the smoke shop and the smoke stove. Get me some old drills so I can smoke more. Yee. Never go get tree on 420. They'll have you waiting dumb ass long. Dang. They took my ID and just kept it. Get my shit back. I low key am pissed though. How the fuck you gonna lose someone's driver's license, bro? And you guys are supposed to be a professional ass delivery or pickup place. You know what I mean? That's my driver's license. I wouldn't care if it was my ID card, you know what I mean? But it's my fucking driver's license, bro. Basically what happened was I pulled up for the little pickup to pick up my tree and then they told me to pull up to the curb. But my dumb ass thought the other curb, so I went over there. I pulled up to the wrong curb, I gave her my ID, and then she ended up coming back saying, what was your name again? Like three times. Then they said, I'm gonna be real with y'all, we lost your driver's license. I was like, what the fuck, bro? I need to drive back home, I need that shit. Right now I'm raw dogging it in the streets. Driving without a license. I feel naked. Raw dog. So you know I gotta drive the speed limit, man. I can't be speeding without a license, you know? Whoa. You know what I mean? I don't want to draw too much attention on me. Alright, after this video, there's gonna be me with my little theories that go on, go on in my head. It triggers in my head and then, I don't know, these theories just pop up. Like, what if what if I was supposed to do something, right? And I have certain helpers, whatever. Because they know that I'm not going to be able to do it. So what if someone took my ID? Because they know that another person needs it. They took my shit. Then the people who need it, I don't know. The people who need it disguise themselves as somebody that you ran into or you've seen before. Or anybody you've seen, they make themselves look like that person because they know that you're not going to know who they are. Like, let's say I see an old person walking, right? And then later on, I see that old person. It's the same person that I was editing and my dumb ass, my dumb ass said that you're wrong. I meant it's the same person's futures and shit. So you, you see somebody with the same face, the same nose, the same eyes. Or the same walk, how he talks. It's the same features, but a whole different person. Disguising themselves or making me reprogram them to seeing them different. So I could be looking at a person, but somebody else sees that a whole completely different person. But we're looking at the same person. Crazy how people can fuck with your mind. And it sucks how they know I won't speak. They know I won't say shit about it. So they have to make me say it. They have to do certain shit where I'm pissed and then I say it. That's their little strategy every time I talk. If you notice every time I talked, I was pissed at something or somebody. They do these certain little quirks or certain little shit that would get me mad into speaking about certain shit that I'm not supposed to be speaking about. So if somebody so happens to watch this and I said some certain shit, it ain't my fault. I had no choice but to think that some shit was going to happen unless I smoke or unless I talk. Nah, but for real though, I'm not sad about it. I'm kind of mad about it. Nah, I'm not mad about it. I just need it. I need it and they took it away. I'm just trying to figure out how how you got me here with
let the wheels spin. I'm just trying to figure out how how they got me here with my wheels spinning. I walked outside the bando in my sandal. 